We have continuing coverage now on the pair of Texas billionaires, the Wilkes brothers, buying up private land across southwest Idaho and blocking access to public lands in some areas. We've been hearing from hundreds of you on social media. A lot of you are outraged, asking questions. You have a lot of concerns. Some of you are siding with the rights of the property, the private property owners. Our Morgan Boydston is following this story and sheds more light for us. Let's put the situation in the Boise National Forest in context. This is a map Boise County sent me, and all of these areas in orange are land that DF Development owns. That's the company owned by Dan and Ferris Wilkes, billionaires from Cisco, Texas, who made their bucks in masonry and in the hydraulic fracking industry. DF put up gates over a forest service road that runs through their private property and leads to public lands. NFS 374, also known by many locals as Boise Ridge Road, is a popularly traveled road for hunters and recreationists past Bogus Basin. This is the road in the Boise National Forest. Zooming in right here, it says National Forest Development Road 374, and you can see all this yellow around it. That's DF Development Land. Hoff Companies is another large private landowner along this road. We zoom out, and you'll see there's much more. All over Boise County, DF Development owns parcels of land up near Harris Creek Road, east of Pioneerville, surrounding Centerville, and even north of Crouch. The Boise County Assessor tells me DF Development owns roughly 33,000 acres there, mostly bought in one single transaction in 2016. That is roughly 3% of the 1.2 million square acres that make up Boise County. Now, tracing the history of the majority of DF Development land shows timber companies owned it, First, Boise Cascade, then Potlatch, and then Georgia-based Southern Pine Plantations in 2016. Just months later, DF scooped it up. As I reported on Wednesday, the Wilkes are selling 11,240 acres Boise Ridge Road runs through, listed as a, quote, prime timber private ranch for 10.3 million. The biggest question that remains, do the Wilkes have the right to put these gates on a Forest Service road that runs through their property but cuts off access to people's public land. I was able to find out the Forest Service has what's called perfected access up to certain points on that property, but there's a couple segments on that road they're still trying to figure out their access. A lot of you brought up prescriptive easements on social media, which attorneys told me Idaho law does recognize. They can be tricky to prove, and you do need a lot of factual evidence. There are easements created by use. There's no signed or recorded document, but they come about when someone has been notoriously openly and continuously using the land for years. If a prescriptive easement is argued in this situation, it would likely have to be taken to court. The Texas brothers don't just own land in Boise County. They own hundreds of thousands of acres in Adams and Valley counties, too. We'll continue to follow this story. We know there's a lot of interest across Idaho.